Greetings, it's been quite a while since I've made a video. Today I've managed to get hold of a Time Wave 59 Plus DSP or DSP 59 Plus, which is a digital signal processing audio filter as opposed to the Datong, which I've got over here. This is an analog one, so that there's no DSP processing in that, that just uses the actual. Uh, filters that are built into the, the unit to do the uh, higher and lower uh, filtering of the uh, bandwidth so you can set it for CW and other modes. This also handles all the different modes, it's a rather complex numbering system and things around the edge but basically uh, you press the buttons and tune around until you get the best signal. The moment I've got it on 40 meters tuned in some, some radio amateurs with a sort of a news uh, bulletin or, or whatever you want to call it, club, weekly club roundup of news, amateur radio news. So I'll just switch it on and you can hear it. The Kenwood R, uh, turn it off now, sorry, Kenwood R600. Because the signal's faded away now, we have to wait for it to come back again. And it seems to have shifted in frequency a bit. It's better. That's with the filter off. You can hear the buzzing sound in the speaker in the background there. That's the speaker in the room. So now I switch the unit on. It cleans up the signal and brings out the audio quite nicely, I think. You've got a volume here and a volume there on the radio, so you can also boost the volume here a bit. If you do it too high, and that little red light should light up there, it's not doing it at the moment, but it's definitely overloading at the moment. Now it's faded away again now. It's bypass. You can hear virtually nothing. The signal's gone, so that's unfortunate. It is, uh, what's the time here to the, now? It's local time, seven o'clock. So that's 1900, so it looks like the, uh, oh wait a minute, I must have knocked the frequency dial, I wonder. Then I did that. That's better. That's better. It's with a filter on. Filter off. Now watch how it brings the voice out. Brings it to the full, you can hear it quite clearly. So it definitely does a good job uh, of tidying up the signal. Got it set at the moment using the um, upper and lower cutoffs on the DSP, and I set the bandwidth to about, I think it's about 2.8, and then on a 400, so that's 2.4, which is a sort of standard CW, uh, sorry, SSB bandwidth on most radios. talking over all the background noise there, so I don't know whether this is going to be any good or not, but we'll have a listen and see. I just want to switch off. <laughs> I don't 